Hey there guys, Ducktaculous Gaming here, and this is my new and improved 2015 Minecraft server tutorial. I have had lots and lots and lots of requests to make this, and I kind of hate redoing videos. I like people think, oh, it's just doing it for like the views. I'm really not. I'm the only reason I'm making this is for those people that, that have requested for a newer uh, a video, and so I'm gonna make this video fast for you guys. I'm gonna make it as simple as possible and as straightforward as possible so all the links will be down in the description of what you need and I'll just show you guys what you need to do and it's gonna be really fast and really short I guess that's the same thing fast and short okay anyways let's get started so go to your first link in the description and it will bring you to this page and right underneath multiplayer server on the minecraft website click minecraft underscore server and this will work for any version that you have honestly uh, whatever version it is whenever you're watching this video it will work trust me so drag that to your desktop or drag that to wherever I guess I just I, I would honestly just do exactly what I do if you wanna if you don't wanna make any mistakes but now you wanna make a uh, folder and just name it whatever does not matter so I'm naming this server you can it doesn't matter what you name it to be honest so you put it in the folder and all I want you guys to do is just double click and it's just loading so now it loads a few files but this is one thing that has changed over the past few months or years I guess it used to just make the, the, the whole all the files and all that but now you have to click on EULA I don't know how to pronounce that EULA click on that and one thing you want to do is make sure you open it with notepad so open I mean mine's already in notepad and if you have a Windows computer notepad is already in uh, installed on your computer like whenever you have a Windows computer notepad comes with it so you don't have to download that or anything so now what you're gonna do you can also see, see all this and see this this link right here you want to copy this no you don't you don't have to do this but this is just gonna show you all the I guess rules so here we go let's just I'm not gonna read it at all because it's like honestly so much but I'm just gonna show you real quick so it has it just like a license agreement and I'm not gonna read but you guys can read it if you want but you're supposed to read it now right where it says false right here this is what you gotta do so watch carefully you see false you want to delete that and you want to type in true make sure you spell it just like I do and then you want to save so usually I just click exit and then ask me if I want to save if I save it and you're good now you have to double click this server again and now wow it's working now we haven't completed the whole thing yet we do have to download and install Hamachi which is a great great thing for minecraft servers and I'll show you guys how to use it in just a second so our server has started we can just type in down here stop and click enter and then it will stop or you can just exit it but the, the proper way is to, to type in stop and then and then enter that in so now as you can see we have all these files and or all these like notepad things and band IPs band players uh, like the world whitelist so Let's just, let me just teach you guys a little bit. Whitelist, if you want to whitelist people, you just want to type your, their names in, in here, so like, you, and you want to type in their, uh, their like, uh, Minecraft name, so I would type in Ducktaculous Gaming, although I'm not doing whitelist, so let me just not save that, I'm not, I just want to like show you guys that. Now the main thing what I, I need you guys to do is go on server, and I would like you guys to spend a few minutes just on your own looking through this, and it's really straightforward, so everything like, Game mode 0 means survival, game mode, if you can change it to game mode 1, that means creative. If you want, you know, difficulty, if you want PvP to be false, you can change it to false. It's had, like, online mode, that that's for a different video, I guess. Max build height, 256, that's regular. I, I, I don't suggest changing much of this, but little things, like, if you want, you can change. Now, the thing that we need right here is the server IP, so... Highlight, I'm going to highlight that and then I will come back to that. So, next go to the second link in your description and it will take you to here. This is a completely no virus, completely safe website. Trust me, I've downloaded this, I've used it, like, not hundreds of times, but dozens of times. And it works for Mac or Windows. So, I want you to click right here, unmanaged. On, under the un unmanaged, I want you to just check this and click download now. And I've actually downloaded and installed it, but I'm just going to kind of show you guys. So you, once you have downloaded it, I want you to double click on it. And it's going to go through this install. You click next. You click 
next few more times and then it's going to install. Now I have already installed it just to save a little bit of time. So let me just open it up real quick. Here we are. So it will take you to, to this basically and it's, it's going to be really quick to install. It's nothing, nothing like like nothing out of the blue so anyways it'll take you here and I want you guys to click create a new network and you have to do your network ID which is the network name basically so I'm just gonna do ducktaculus gaming uh, tutorial hopefully I spelled it wrong if I, or right I mean <laughs> if I spelled it wrong then who cares I want to I want to make this fast so you guys can have a server as fast as possible so password I will I suggest uh, making it really simple just because it doesn't matter if other people get into this network it's not like it's not like your like Facebook account or your YouTube account password it's it's more like a like a password that you can tell tell other people so I'm just gonna do one two three and one two three to confirm the password create the octaculous gaming tutorial and we have that done so now what I want you guys to do is just uh, right click right up here and copy the IPv4 address and that's very important now, like I was saying, we need to highlight the server IP because the IPv4 address is our server IP. So that is 25.19.108.22. Now, there we have it. That's another step closer to having our, our uh, server. So let's just open this back up. And it looks like we're good. Oh, one more thing. Let's open up server. Where does it say? Uh, I, if I can't see it real quick, I'm, I'm not going to waste time. It's just, it's just something for fun. Uh, there's supposed to be a message of the day or something like that. I can't see it. Oh, down here. Message of the day. At the very bottom, let's change it to Ducktaculus Gaming Tutorial. Um, and, I'll, and you'll be able to see it. I don't know if I spelled it wrong, but all right. Ah, I'm making all these. I don't know. I can't, I can't speak. Anyways, save that. Let's get out of here. Minimize that. Let's open up some Minecraft. 1.8.2 I believe or maybe I don't know let's just hit 1.8 I guess now let's play this bad boy here we go here we are now we're gonna go to multiplayer add server I'm not gonna do the name just to save you guys some time and click control V control V and it will paste your IPv4 address which we already previously copied now I'm gonna click done now we're gonna scroll all the way down now, this should be it. It says we can't connect. Let's see. Oh man. Ooh, my phone's going off. All right, here we go. Let's try again. I did not start the server. Here we are. Sorry about my phone, guys. I was like, what? Why is my server not on? Anyways, remember to start your server. Okay, guys. I was like, wait, what did I do wrong? This this should work. So okay, let's refresh real quick. Scroll down. Ah, there we go, Ducktaculous Gaming Tutorial, and we can join in. And if you guys would like to know how to create a server icon, I've actually created a tutorial on that. But anyways, guys, like I like I did, uh, I said to creative, and we're in creative. I set the MOTD to uh, Ducktaculous Gaming Server Tutorial, and it's down here, and we, we're connected. And so you can uh, set how many players you would like, like would be able to join like as you can see like other people are 45 20 20 20 and yeah so uh, this is pretty sick and as you can see I've I had this previously but that's my tutorial guys I hope this helped you if you have any questions feel free to uh, ask me ask me anything I'll try to answer as fast and as well as I can also if this helped you please leave a like maybe subscribe maybe watch some of my other videos you guys are awesome I will see you all later. I love you guys. Stay happy.